Hi, it's me again with Corel Draw Tips and Tricks. And today's little video is going to be a lady on Facebook made a comment that she uh, engraved something and she didn't have any idea how to cut it out. Okay, I've got this thing lassoed and my weld tools are gone. So you know you've got it grouped together, so go ungroup. Then lasso it and your weld tools appear. So go to create a boundary. Now, that's good. You've just made a cut line around your object. And I like working with everything in the center of the page for a lot of reasons. And here's one of them exactly. We're going to group this back together. I'm going to hit P on the keyboard. It's going to put it in the center of the page. I'm going to put that back in the center of the page. But you can see our cut line, which is this red line, is right on top or just a little bit past the engraving. And let's say you want to make a little bit bigger outline. I don't see any way to do it with the weld tool, but go up to Arrange or Effects, Contour, and we're going to contour it just a little bit, 0 0.02, to the outside. Press Apply. Go up to Arrange, Break Contour Apart. Try grabbing just the outside one. Hit P on your keyboard. And now you've got a little bit bigger outline. So you're going to have some good wood here or acrylic or however you're going to do it of your item. But all, all items aren't created equal. This item is a solid block they'll really so let's say you engraved it and you want that but if you contour it it's making a copy and, and coloring it in so let's put it back in the center of the page let's go to range break contour part now that they're both copies it's hard to tell which one's the smaller one click on it i've got 3.47 this one i've got 3.67 so here's my original. So what you can do to make your contour lines now is go up to the left click your mouse, no fill, go down to red, right click your mouse, press P on the keyboard, P on the keyboard, and now you've got this thing that's going to cut out. And a lot of times, let's say, I don't want that center part cut out. Go up to range, break curve apart, hit that piece and delete it. Now it's only going to cut out your outline. Anyway, hope that helped a little bit and thank you for watching.